Alright everybody, welcome back to another Destiny 2 video. In today's video, I'm still playing on my uh, Hunter. Still using Blade Barrage. Actually, in this video, we're using the Stompies. In my last video, I didn't for some reason. And um, I'm using this Botherin. Botherterian? I don't even know how to pronounce that. Botherration? Botherration? I don't know, but just some blue shoddy. The main, using my hammerhead again, but the main point of this video is this horribly ruled uh, waking visual. I think this is one of my favorite hand cannons in the game because not a lot of people got good rules on them because they were hard to get from the last city. This is a dog shit rule, a zen moment, outlaw, flared magwell, and um, true sight with a stability rule and I just threw a free hand grip on it. It's something different to use especially as we're winding down to this season. There isn't really much to talk about and um, I'm getting excited for next week so I figured I'd just use it and with sunsetting coming I think not next season but in September I could be wrong. Is it next season? No I think it's September whenever it's coming. But um, I figured I'd just use it. I was kind of just searching through my vault, looking at some weapons, and I seen this. So I figured I'd make a video on it. Like I said, there isn't too much really to talk about in the Destiny world as we come close to the end of this season. But with that being said, I hope you guys all have been doing good. I hope you guys have a good rest of your Monday. And uh, I'll check you guys in the game. That's uh, that's kind of unlucky, to be honest. Uh, we go again. So like I was saying, as we approach a new season in destiny 2 i'm getting excited um they still really haven't said anything and um yesterday was the event so let's talk about that live event shall we would it first off you know what was your guys' thoughts i'll give you my thoughts on the event i think it was really fucking cool it was something different it wasn't to the degree of the fortnite events obviously they weren't really like game changing crazy like fortnite was like the travis scott concert and the marshmallow event and all kind of different stuff that they did in different collabs i think that's just that's unmatchable and i think anybody who had that expectation was wrong in a way i think everybody knew we weren't going to get that type of degree of event it's kind of destiny 2's first ever or bungee's rather first live event with the game and i think it was it was cool i think it opens up a lot of opportunity in the future and I do think it was a little long. I uploaded a video yesterday kind of just showing the main points of it or the main emphasis of it, if that makes sense. Like just the main kind of event itself, not the whole waiting around because I think it, it ended up being what, almost two hours, two, two and a half hours, hour and a half or something like that. So it, it was long and I mean, I, I could see where they're coming from. I like that they're giving people a grace period to join. You know, they say one o'clock, but... Okay, I'm getting fucking shit on, but that's because I'm talking. I'm going to use that as, as an excuse. But I like how they gave everybody a grace period to kind of come in, get ready. So they just didn't miss it. Oh my, oh my. <laughs> he has power. Try to focus up here and do something. No, he's using the Arbalist. It looked like he had power. Yeah, this is definitely a dog shit roll, but I think just the gun itself is pretty good. Wow, maybe I have better connection than him. Wow, man, do it through my dodge. Yeah, dog chip rule waking visual. I think it's a fun gun to use though. And I never use it. Like I said, I was kind of just... There isn't much to make videos on and talk about. So I was kind of just browsing through my vault. And this is just what we came up with. Jeez, my man's getting gunned like that. Hey, my nade... No, wow, my nade didn't even hit him. But let me know what your guys' thoughts were about the event. I thought it was cool. It was something different, obviously, the first time Bungie really ever experimented with it. And I think, um, like I said, I think it opens up a lot for the future. Oh, we didn't have it. There's fucking people everywhere. And I want to flick and smack my mic, sorry. Don't 
Jeez, I'm getting gunned. No! Get him out. That's something I wanted to talk to you guys about too. Do you guys bounty stack for the next season? I kind of feel like... Wow, there are a lot of fucking people over here. I kind of feel like everybody does. And I really don't see any... Wow. I really don't see anything wrong with that. I think at this point it's kind of like part of the game and it's kind of Bungie's fault for I guess allowing people to do it. Plus, I mean, what kind of advantage do you get? I guess the artifact, you get to boost up a little bit and um, what, you get maybe a couple new rewards quicker. You get to level up in the battle pass a little bit quicker. So I don't really think it's like game breaking. I don't think it's like, eh, I guess it's kind of a scumbag thing to do. Wow, these guys really don't want us to get A. My fuck. We have a lot of supers though, we should use them. Another thing I wanted to address was just basically the uploads and the upload schedule and how I feel like I want to do this and the best way I think I can be successful at doing it is kind of just uploading sporadically. You know, maybe one week I'll upload two or three videos, maybe the next week. Oh, Twitch streamer. Maybe the next week I'll upload like four or five. Like next week, for instance, this video I'm making on Sunday, I'm gonna upload it Monday. So I hope you guys all have a good rest of your Sunday, good Monday morning, and a good Monday back to work for everybody working their summer jobs now that we're closer into the green phase. And um, I think, you know, like next week with the new season coming out, I'd like to upload, I don't know, really whatever I see. When, whenever I try to like force videos, I don't really like it. And I kind of stopped doing that. I like to kind of just upload whatever, whatever's on my mind really, like if I get a new gun or a cool gun that I want to use, I'll upload it. Or if I see something that not a lot of people are talking about, maybe I'll make a video talking about that. But that's kind of, wow, I ran out of ammo. But that's kind of how I always been, like I wasn't like, okay, new season, I have to do this, I have to do this, I have to try to upload really fast. like. I don't really even know how much I'm going to be able to play on Tuesday when the new season drops because of work. And anyway, I'm fine with that. I think someone's behind me. And we don't know a lot about this season, and I think that that's really cool in a way. I know they said that the, uh, the name was leaked, the season of Arrival. That's what it's going to be called. But other than that, that's really all we know. So I think... Um, just upload wise it's a heads up it's going to be kind of spontaneous i don't plan on like okay i want to make four videos a week or i want to upload every monday wednesday friday you know i don't really want to do that so i think they're just going to be sporadic as they come as i kind of have time and as i'm in the mood to make videos too and i think it'll make the videos better the quality better because i'll be excited i'll be in the mood to play or does that make sense everything i'm saying making sense i hope it is But nonetheless, even though we don't know too much, I'm excited. I haven't really been playing Destiny 2 a lot. And I have been these past few, I guess, week. Week and a half. And uh, the return of videos is really cool. I'm excited. I enjoy making videos again, and I think that was the biggest thing. So even though the game's in a bad state, it doesn't really matter if you enjoy what you're doing. Shouldn't have really taken this gunfight from right there. And lastly, I want to talk about Trials. I'm really excited for Trials next season since it'll actually be the appropriate light level. At least I hope. That is the plan. And I want to start playing Trials. Definitely. I, I don't... See, I'm not really good at D2 PC. Uh, see, as you, as you can tell... So I don't know what I'm going to do because I don't really have anyone to play with either. So I don't really know what I want to do. Um, I don't know. Probably try to get a carry from somebody. Who knows? Any of you guys want to carry me to uh, carry me to the lighthouse? It would be greatly appreciated.
But it's something I always enjoyed in Destiny 1, and I really didn't get to play much at all in Destiny 2. The first Trials of the Nine I did, when the game first came out, but other than that, I really didn't get to play Trials at all, really. So that's something I'm excited about, and overall, I'm just excited in general. I know I always say this, but we'll see what's happening. We'll see what happens Tuesday. And um, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I didn't play too, too bad. I'm not, I'm not used to like playing and talking again and focusing. I guess I kind of did play pretty bad. But regardless, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, please leave a like. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Take care.